what's up in this video i'll be showing you guys how to import your brushes from photoshop to clip studio paint so if you have your brush from if you're coming from photoshop and you have a brush that you like there and you want to transfer to clip studio paint what you want to do if, if you have clip studio paint is go over to this sub 2 menu here sub 2 if you can't see the sub 2 menu just go over to windows and then you click on this sub 2 here also this is the true, pro true property but you click on this sub 2 here and you're going to have your sub 2 menu and you're going to have your sub 2 menu then you go over to this settings here and then you click on it and then you click on import sub 2 there once you click on the import sub 2 then you go here your photoshop brush is here i'm going to import this rocks and water brushes here abr file that's going to be a photoshop brush and then you click on it also note that you won't be able to click as many brushes as you want to import you have to import them one by one so what you want to do is click on the one that you want to import i'm going to click on this rocks and water brushes here and then you click on open and then it will take some time for it to import as you can see registering image materials here and then once you have it imported you can now edit the brushes that you have here so as you can see here you have these brushes here also if you want to delete them you can't also delete them you can't click select all and delete you have to delete them one by one right click on it and then delete sub 2 that's how you delete it or you click on the sub 2 that you want to delete and then go over to this delete button here and then you delete it also if you want to change the name of your sub 2 you can right, cl right click on the sub 2 and go to the sub 2 group settings and then you can change the name of the, the brushes that you want also the name of the brushes here if you want to change the name of the brushes you can right click on it go to sub 2 settings here and then you change the name from this to whatever name you want maybe rocks and you can see the names the name has updated here so that's it for this video i'll see you guys in the next